So let's just look at how we review the top organic landing pages over the last 90 days. Right? Let's do that. So we knew it's something like this. We go to acquisition and do things. I've got my glasses up, I still can't see this shit. Um, page search, because organic's not in a demo account. And then you just go to the landing page, and there you go. You've literally got the data. Change the date range, take a screenshot, export it, jobs are good. It took you five minutes. In GA4, it looks like this. Right? <laughs> Everyone gets pissed off because, <laughs> firstly, the landing page report doesn't exist. It's not a thing, right? It, it, it's not there. The data's there, but the report is not there. Then you need to go and build the report, right? which is probably about 20 minutes and lots of swearing. Then you need to add that new report to your navigation, right? and then you have to work out whether other people in the same organization as you can see the changes you've made. right? Then you need to create a filter for the organic channel. right? It's, it's boring. Um, if you are interested in doing this, by the way, because landing pages are quite important. There's a great tutorial here. I could not take credit for this. I did not make it, but it's wonderful. It's concise. But it's about 3,000 words long, right? And this is the epitome of why GA4 is a pain in the ass. Um, right. Point B, there's a lot more work needed to get to the same data in GA4 than you used to have in Universal Analytics. As I said, GA is no longer an analytics tool for marketers. But it can be. Right? For just nine ninety nine a month. If you start up to now, joking, right? Um, so <laughs> but the, the thing is you need to do is combine it with like Google Data Studio, right? Forget GA4's interface because it's dog shit. It really is bad. And I'm sorry if anyone here is an advocate for Google or whatever, but like facts are facts, man, it hurts. Alright, the truth hurts. But GA4 is a beast. And I absolutely adore it, but it only makes sense if you combine it with a front end that actually works, right? So this is how we do it.